Hello everyone and welcome to another video. So we've just had some news to say that Jodie Whittaker and Chris Chibnall will be leaving Doctor Who together in the autumn of next year, 2022. According to an article on the show's official BBC website, Jodie and Chibnall will leave Doctor Who in a trio of specials culminating in, in an epic blockbuster special to air in autumn 2022 as part of the BBC's centenary celebrations. Also, the article said that Series 13 will be a six-part event series, with two specials having already been planned to follow it in 2022, in addition to the newly announced third one. This therefore means that, seri that Series 13 will be made up of six main episodes, with three additional specials then following it next year. I'm not too sure what to think about this news. I will admit that I'm not surprised that Jodie Whittaker is leaving, since she will have done the usual three series as well as a few additional specials by the time she leaves next autumn. But it is very surprising that Chris Chibnall is leaving too. The previous two showrunners, Russell T Davis and Stephen Moffat, each stayed on the show and wrote for two Doctors, but Chibnall will only have written for one. There's no denying that the Chris Chibnall era has been very divisive Mons fans, and whilst I'm, no, I'm by no means a not my doctor sort of person, I do have my own issues with the era, but I'd hoped that things might get better as Chibnall went on, and I'd really wanted to, really wanted Jodie to stay on for a bit longer, given that I don't really think her doctor's been given enough of a chance to truly shine in the part. But now, of course, that won't happen. According to Chibnall, he and Jodie made a free series and out packed with each other, and added, so now our shift is done and we're handing back the TARDIS keys. He also then said, I wish our successors, whoever the BBC and BBC Studios choose, as much fun as we've had. They're in for a treat. I will link the full article in the description box below. I wouldn't be surprised if John Bishop and Mandip Gill cho choose to leave with Jodie and Chibnall next autumn as well. Also, since we'll be getting specials next year, I think it might be likely that we won't get Series 14 until probably 2023 in time for the 60th anniversary. Which I'm not too happy about, but if that turns out to be the case, I can understand why given that there's going to be a change of showrunner as well as a change of Doctor. But like many fans, I'm sure I'm now wondering what comes next. I personally think that somebody like Maxine Alderton or Pete McTie would be great as the next showrunner, and I'd love someone like Tania Miller or Michael Sheen to be the next Doctor. No matter who the BBC chooses, I'm really looking forward to seeing who the next Doctor and showrunner will be. And maybe fans', fans concerns over the writing will be addressed. According to a Radio Times article, the BBC will announce who will be the next Doctor and showrunner soon, probably within the next few months. But who knows right now? We'll just, ha we'll just have to wait and see. Anyway, so thanks for watching, hope you liked it. Please don't forget to click that subscribe button below, as well as press the bell icon at the side, so that you'll be notified of when all my new videos come out. This channel currently has 360 subscribers as of the time of writing and recording this video. But if we're able to get to 500 by the end of this year, then I'll rank every single TV companion from 1963 to the present. Also, please rate and comment below your thoughts on this news and who you want to be the next Doctor and showrunner. And if you have any questions for my upcoming Q&A, then please comment them below. The deadline for all questions is the 17th of September at 11.59pm UK time. So, until next time, bye-bye!